life for humans has improved dramatically in the last 200 years. Abundant energy has led them to greater prosperity and brought them closer together. They export and import goods, travel around the globe, and choose to live and work in different places. But if they want to keep all that progress and save their home planet, they have to turn away from oil and coal. Smart engineers develop ways to get electricity from the sun and wind. But that's not always as reliable and efficient as they'd wish. So they use them as an addition to the old, dirty technology they need <coughs> to completely abandon. And storing that electric energy remains to be a big challenge, especially for mobility. But there are smarter ways to solve that. Humans could use the little used energy source of moving water especially the enormous power I provide, the tides. And as I am always on schedule, my tides are very predictable. The engineers from Cyclone are working to quickly and inexpensively build small floating turbines. And they intelligently connect them along the coast to provide reliable and clean energy 24-7, along with wind and solar. But how could they store that energy and use it for mobility? The traditional battery is very expensive, heavy, and doesn't last long enough to really be sustainable. And the vast majority of transportation today runs on fossil fuel anyway. In the future, we may build our vehicles differently. But we need a solution now. Synthetic fuels from coal and tar sand have been massively produced since World War II. But could there be a cleaner way? Well, actually, there is. Using only renewable electric energy, water and air, we can produce absolutely clean liquid fuels. Electricity can be used to break up water and get hydrogen. Finally, carbon dioxide is added. The carbon is taken out of the air, so e-fuels are actually climate neutral. We take it, release it, take it, release it, and so on. So, why don't humans use them? Well, e-fuels were always considered very expensive because during the fabrication process, a lot of energy gets lost. But that stands and falls with the price of clean electric energy. Cyclone found in studies that with their turbines, they could produce electricity at under one cent per kilowatt hour. And that is truly a game changer. At this price, e-fuels become profitable and can be sold at the same price as regular gasoline. And you can keep driving your petrol or diesel car without any adjustments. Carbon neutral e-fuels also help the climate and that's what Cyclone has been working on for over 12 years. Their turbines actually move pretty slow, despite producing so much energy. So they won't bother the inhabitants of the oceans at all. They are adjustable in size, and they can build ones that are five times smaller than wind turbines, but are equally effective, or even bigger ones with the same affordable fabrication process. Plus, 
only cyclone turbines are able to generate electricity from slow tides as well. Over two-thirds of the planet is covered with water. And the biggest cities are already close to slow, big tides. So let's use this and think big, but build small and smart. Pledge your support for Tidal Energy now and support us by simply sharing this video and telling everyone about it. You can find out more at cyclone.earth.